Hello, and welcome to Brett Dupree's Awesome Hell Journey. I am, of course, Brett Dupree, doing some arm things for Katarina, because she keeps on mentioning I'm not doing anything with my arms lately. Uh, today, I am going to talk about something that is seems to be starting this week. I don't know if um, this is an outlier, but um, I'm not hungry. I just ate a banana and I'm about to drink my muscle milk, which I drink for the extra protein. To because you know my weight loss doctor is like make sure you eat your protein so I'm making sure I eat my protein but I increased my ozempic dose to uh, 0 0.75 milligrams instead of 0 0.5 and I think I've officially hit the point where I'm not very hungry um it was weird because like on Monday I thought I wasn't hungry because I ate uh, a sausage bacon san sandwich with hollandaise sauce for lunch um, and that was just so fat, you know, I had a lot of fat in it, and when I eat a lot of fat, the way Ozempic works, it slows down your digestion, and if you eat a lot of things that are hard to digest, it's just, you feel kind of nauseous, um, and that's how I felt on Monday, but then yesterday, I ate all day, and I was not remotely hungry once, it was like, the way I describe it is, have you ever been to a buffet and you ate so much food, you're uncomfortably full, where the thought of eating makes you feel kind of like, right? You know, I'm doing like throw up. That's what it's like. Um, and how much I, if I eat a bigger meal, it gets worse. But like normally I'm just, I'm not hungry. And that's odd. That's something I've never experienced uh, before, honestly. Uh, I don't know if it's going to last or how long it's going to last. I'm doing 0.75 again on Sunday, which is my second dose. And then if I don't feel bad, go up to one. But, um, yeah. So, this, I think, is a good time to really put intuitive eating into effect. Because I think nutrition is very important. I've talked to my nutritionist and my um, therapist about this. But... My goal is kind of a slower weight loss. I don't want to, because it looks like this is something you can just intermittently fast with and lose a bunch of weight at once, but that's not the way I want to do this because, number one, it's less sustainable, especially if I don't ch cut my stomach in half. Uh, and number two, it's healthier to lose weight slower because, uh, you know, losing weight fast is, mal is most likely put you in a state of malnutrition. And I don't want to do that. Um, and, you know, you got to make sure you get your vitamins and all that stuff. And my goal is to not take vitamins because they're expensive. They're pricey. Pricey things. And if I can just eat, get it by normal eating, I'm going to try for that. So, basically what I'm saying is this is new territory for me. So I really need to put my intuitive eating uh, skills into effect because you know remember intuitive eating isn't hunger eating it's eating towards what you think at least you, your body needs are and like tapping into your body in fact uh, looking at this muscle milk i don't really want it i just ate a banana and i just feel kind of like Bleh. i don't like feeling Bleh. so yeah so i'm learning how to deal with that in this new reality as i'm on this medication to um help my you know insulin and all that stuff and so, yeah, that's just what I want to talk about. Just uh, learning what life is like not being hungry. So we'll see how this continues and stay tuned for more stuff and updates. Um, yeah. Woo!